A Minneapolis man who was charged with firing a gun at police officers is now suing 19 of them. The charges against Jaleel Stallings were eventually dropped, but he is now accusing them of excessive force during his arrest after the murder of George Floyd. Fox 9's Mary McGuire has the story. He can't go back to what happened before this incident. After being acquitted of criminal charges earlier this year, Jaleel Stallings is now suing 19 Minneapolis police officers for excessive force. It was an unprecedented time in Minneapolis, but you also have to recognize there are policies in place, there are rules in place dictating how you respond to that. Sitting alongside his client, attorney Eric Rice outlined the civil suit filed Thursday, which argues Stallings constitutional and equal protection clause rights were violated when he was arrested in May of last year. There's a reason that officers don't get to just use as much force whenever they want. And that's part of what this lawsuit is about is keeping officers to proper uses of force and having accountability for improper uses of force. <laughs> The incident was all caught on police body camera. Stallings claims he didn't know he was shooting at police and acted in self-defense when he returned fire at an unmarked van of people firing less lethal rounds. Put your hands on your I'm I'm Court filings say when Stallings found out they were police, he surrendered and dropped his weapon. But officers continued to beat him, fracturing his eye socket. Former Minneapolis Police Union President Bob Kroll is also named in the lawsuit, even though he wasn't directly involved in the incident. There's been reporting that he had discussions with city officials and with officers surrounding that May 30th time frame, that he may have encouraged officers to use less lethal weaponry in the manner that they did against Jaleel. The city of Minneapolis is also named in this lawsuit. I'm told the city attorney is currently in the process of reviewing it and they can't comment about it at this time. The Minneapolis Police Department also tells me they can't speak on any pending litigation. Reporting in St. Paul, Mary McGuire, Fox 9.